Hey. What are you doing out here, big guy? You're my Godzilla, aren't you? <laughs> you, didn't, you didn't want to participate in yesterday's chaos. You just decided to sit here on the sidelines and watch the mega kaiju battle go down. Well, you're a smart one. I, I respect that. That was a smart decision. <laughs> Guys, welcome back. Welcome back to our Mega Modern Survival. Uh, yeah, yesterday was... It was a thing that we should probably put in our past. Not because anything went wrong, aside from losing just about all of our kaiju teams, uh, including Silitha over here. Oh my gosh, what are you doing up there, Kaiten? Uh, but we pretty much... <laughs> <laughs> the way he's just looking at us. We pretty much sacrificed all of our uh, kaiju against the one, the mega, the, uh, the the mecha, more like it. Mecha Godzilla. Um, and it, it seems that, uh, well, it, there was another survivor that I, I had no idea about. Well, I, I, should I bring you? I guess I can just leave you out here to roam for the eternity. I mean, you didn't want to participate and help out your buddies yesterday. So uh, I guess I'll, you know what? You can, just, you, can just, you, can just, you can just live out here on your own, buddy. You didn't want to pull your weight. Not as much as I respect it. No, I don't. You're a little coward. You're a little coward. But guys, welcome back. Welcome to our Mega Modern Survival. Uh, okay, Manticore. Thanks for dropping me from such a high height. Guys, uh, the the Rob the Rex plushie sale has ended. That's right. Uh, between last episode and this one, uh, that is it. They're done. We've sold them all. They're never to be bought again. Thank you to everyone who made it such a successful campaign. I never expected to sell the amount of plushies that we did. And it means so much to me that so many of you uh, were interested in picking one up. Uh, we ended up selling 1,330, give or take, plus the stack that I bought. I bought 40 of them. <laughs> I bought 40 Rob the Rex plushie toys. Why did I buy 40 of them? I don't know, but I think they're pretty cool. And now I'm going to have a box in my garage full of them. No, I was thinking um, that could be really, really cool to use as like in giveaways and stuff like that in the future. I just wanted like a, a stash of them for the memory. And then maybe you can do some giveaways with them in the future. Um, so yeah, but keep an eye out for those because that's going to be months away. I'm pretty sure they like ship in August. But thanks everybody. Thanks to everybody who um, participated in that sale. It really is uh, very, very humbling that you guys got involved. I was a little nervous that no one would want them. But um, hey, it turns out a lot of you did. Uh, but anyways, let's get get into today we got a big one planned if you do enjoy the video please go ahead push that thumbs up make it rain those thumbs ups it's good to know that you guys are still around still watching uh we're actually getting pretty close to the end of this series i don't really know where we stand with it i'll be, I'll be honest i don't i don't know how long we've got less left um we obviously we still got a lot to get through okay but i feel like we're nearing that late stage of the series. I feel like we're getting to the end game now, baby. There's still a lot to do though. So uh, don't don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Who knows? Maybe we'll uh, head straight from this into Genesis 2 DLC series. We'll have to wait and see though. Uh, but anyways, what do we have planned for today? Well, there just so happens to be one remaining Pugnacia boss that we are yet to fight. At least one r remaining Pugnacia boss that is like roaming in the wild. Because uh, obviously there are a bunch of Ascension ones that we haven't yet fought. In fact, there's a bunch we haven't even summoned in yet. There's there's still a lot to go through. Um, however, there is this one. We've spotted him a couple times now and now I've forgotten his name. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. I was going to type his name into our thing of a mommy here, but now I've, now I've forgotten his name. Let me just type in the... Because they all seem to be... There he is, I was going to say. They all have, like, the in the name. I'm talking about Skarna. The purveyor of nightmares? Purveyor of nightmares? I don't even know what purveyor means. I might need to search that one up in the dictionary. But we're going to take down this giant poisonous scorpion. Um, that's what we're going to set out to do today. There's a few of them around. Uh, we have found them out of the wild in the past. In fact, we nearly killed one accidentally when they were first introduced to the game because they were a little bit broken, but they've since been, since been fixed. So I don't think we're going to have luck like that again. Uh, also, you see what I see over here, don't you? This crab is guaranteed to roam over to my, my house any second and tear the place up. So let's just take him down. Um, but it kind of leaves me in a bit of a, a funny spot because I don't know who we want to take into this battle with us. We've obviously got our man's core. He's a beast. What more needs to be said? We got we got phoenixes that proved to be quite useful as well. Uh, we got a couple other primevals. We got uh, some primals. I don't think we need primals. We got our glacial gigas. That could be a massive help. Um, we've also got spinebreaker out here. There's a few options for us to uh, consider. Even a dragon, really. We got two dragons. I could go and make another dragon. Actually, do I have dragon babies? Hold on a second. Obviously, our previous dragon baby died. It was it was a sad day. It was a very very sad day. We got a lot of dragon eggs. <laughs> we got so many dragon eggs. I could hatch one of these babies up. 
Yeah, we could do that, actually. You know, I think I'm going to do that anyways. In fact, maybe we get a couple dragon eggs. Because I feel like the time's going to come soon where we need some dragons. Um, I was going to try and hatch them out here. Yeah, I'm going to try and hatch them here. I don't know if it'll let us. Because we're a bit of a distance. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Anyways, we got some dragons down. Fantastic. Three little dragons. I feel like Daenerys Targaryen. There we go again with the Game of Thrones reference. Miola, Game of Thrones is uh, very... It's not, it's not in fashion anymore. They kind of, the writers kind of destroyed it. Yeah, anyways, we don't need to talk about Game of Thrones. It still hurts my soul when I think about it. Uh, but now we've got three baby dragons. And what's beautiful about this item right here is we can speed the process up and basically make them like grow up ridiculously quickly. So we're going to do that. Yes, we are indeed. We just need to set this to, um, I can't remember the, the there's a setting. I got to set this, the extreme, I bet you it was the extreme, no, the growth. Non-adult dinosaurs to grow more rapidly. Yes. Let's do that one. Let's do that one. And now, watch as... There we go. I was going to say, watch as my little babies grow up into really big adults. I was hoping it'd be a little bit quicker than this, but still going to be a little while, I suppose. Hey, 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 I've got an idea what we can do while we're waiting for that. If we end up waiting for that, these guys might just be like contingency plans. They might just be backup plans in case everything else goes wrong today. Uh, we can give them a little paint job. I think you can paint little babies, right? Can I load in? Doesn't look as good as it does in the man's core. Not going to lie. I don't, I don't see any pink. Uh, what if I was to load in that other color that we had? The Zama. Ooh, that's actually kind of tough. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Oh, this catch. Ooh, I'm getting. Oh, I like this. I like this a bit. I like this quite a Quite, quite a, quite a, quite a, ooh. Hold on. Whoa, that's actually, he's a big old frosty fella. All right, what if I were to edit this, this mustard? Oh my gosh, I'm in love. I'm in love. I love it. I love it a bit. Or maybe a little bit of, oh, I'm saving it. I'm saving it. Aqua, aquatic, Aquarius, I should call it. There we go. All right, I like it. I like it. Well, if all goes well today, I might take you out for a spin. We'll see how we go. Uh, one step at a time. Obviously, we're not quite there yet, but damn looks so nice oh my gosh what a good paint job for like three seconds work or say you guys seen that weird artifacty there's like a little every now and then there's a little bit of funky shapes going on i don't know what's what the story is there but it, it just did it again 13 percent of the way there though all right well look i'm gonna let you grow up all three of you uh there's every opportunity every chance that all three of you will die today but let's hope that that doesn't happen uh we are gonna go find a scarner and we're gonna go see uh well i don't even know who i want to like I don't even know who I want to bust out to take him on first up. Uh, we got we got options. We got a lot of options. Um, oh boy. Oh, we we can even take Mr. Fista. Um, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Do we take a glacial giga? A glacial giga could be a good option. You're a. You're, I think this one here is like unleveled though. Oh, you've had some leveling. So we got 79 levels up his sleeve too. Uh, but is it my strong glacial giga? Oh, wait, hold on. Is it you? Are you the good one? Oh, no. Last time we took a Glacial Giga out, it died, didn't it? That's that's why I can't find a, a very strong Glacial Giga. Yeah. That's right. We got him killed. Yeah. We'll probably do exactly the same again today, wouldn't we? All right. All right. All right. Let me let me try my Manticore. Let's go. Let's go, my primeval beast. You've been an absolute beauty to work with so far. Let's see if you can keep it up. So, I definitely saw one on the map uh, just out in this direction. So I guess we'll, we'll pay to visit. Seems to be the closest of the options. Right along the shoreline. That's just a space whale. Oh, hold on. There's a phoenix there as well. Let me just... Let me just... Oh, oh, oh. Didn't quite. There we go. Thank you very much, buddy. Thank you very much. Okay. So I'll check the scanner in a second just to really hone in on the... Oh, Mothra and a dragon. Hey. Don't mind if I do. Every little bit of energy, as you guys know, helps out. Uh, Mothra, on the other hand, is going to avoid Mothra. Last time we ran into Mothra, we died. Yep, we got our own Mothra killed. Um, okay, so we're here. I'm looking for health bars. I'm not seeing no health bars. There might be one up here. Otherwise, I'll just uh, I'll check in with the old scanner. And we'll find it the old-fashioned way. All right, we're checking the scanner. I ain't seeing no, ain't seeing no scanner. So, my friend, where are you, buddy? Where are you? It's... That one. This one here. 8116 is what I am looking for. 8116. So we're looking to go south. Man, I like missed. I missed it by a long shot. Wait, 81. I said 81. Oop, there we go. And now we're going to go east. Oh, we're going up here. 
81, 16. Oh, we must have flown straight over. Wait a second. Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Right down here. All right. There you are, you buddy. There you are, man. Oh, hey. Man, these guys are so common, right? I feel like we've taken on so many of these phoenixes. They're actually everywhere. Also, remember when these guys used to be like a threat? A glacial gigas. Remember when we died to a glacial giga? It was a while ago now. Very definitely some time ago. Um, all right. So, let's do this thing. Let me just take down this. I don't know why I'm trying to fight this ancient rex. Probably a waste of time and a waste of space, but I might get some nice loot from him that I can break down into metal. If I can actually hit him with my... Little, little little spike bombs. Little spike bomb bomb bombs. There we go. There we go. No loot. No loot at all. But that there is our enemy for, for, for right this second. Also, there's two of them. Wait, there's one just over there. Okay, careful. I'm not ready to fight. There's two of them out here, apparently. I, I, I don't remember seeing two on the map, but sure thing. Um, There he is. He's playing his blaring dance music. His little house, house trance session. Um, 144 million health. As we may be used to by now. Uh, and a little, why has he got? He's actually got. Wait, tame, oh yeah. Wait, tameable via KO. Hold on a second. If I was to use this, surely, surely that's wrong. That might be reading wrong. Let me just, let me just sit up here for a second, okay? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna try something out. Yeah, I'm just gonna try something out. Imagine if you could actually knock him out. I don't think you can. I definitely can't. I can't see any armor. Wait, did I shoot? I think I, I shot my man's cord. <laughs> I shot my man's cord just then. Whoopsie. All right. Let me get some of these ready just in case. Imagine if he actually fell asleep. He definitely had fallen asleep. Or if he is, he's got like bajillions of torpor. Because as you can see, absolutely nothing is happening. All right, Magikor. Well, it's time to see what you're made of, buddy. Because clearly I ain't got what it takes. Now, can I use my range attack from up here? Because, hey, if we can fight this battle from... Yeah! I was going to say, if I can fight it from up here, we, may just, we might just do that. <laughs> hey, this might be the easiest battle yet, man. This might be the easiest one yet. There's nothing he can do. Oh, boy. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. I feel like every boss needs, like... Just an undodgeable attack. It sounds silly to say, but uh, if you're gonna survive an arc, I feel like I could even sit up here with my glacial giga and drop glacial attacks. Technically, couldn't I? I could drop our little blizzard bomb, and we're just like damage him like that. Um, I'm gonna be up here for some time if we're gonna battle him like this, though. Uh, this is gonna be a ridiculously long battle. Uh, do I have an X attack or not? Oh yeah, we do. What sort of damage is that dealing? More, more or less? I'm not sure. Probably less. That's less damage. All right, hit him with the original. Back to plan A. Oh, as you can see. Oh. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Okay, I was actually worried about that attack. I forgot about that one. Um, so, that cloud of smoke. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed. You may not have noticed because it happened ridiculously quickly. But he filled my torpor meter, like, entirely. I'm surprised my man's guy didn't fall asleep just then because it looked like it was going to go. Yeah, there it goes again. My torpor meter is like full. And luckily for me, it doesn't quite tip me over the edge. But also lucky for me, I have these uh, these little blue tonics that are going to save my life. Unfortunately, I can't hit him with a melee attack. Otherwise, we would be laughing right now. Uh, but I think this is literally how this battle is going to play out, man. I just got to remember these attacks. So we're not, we're not at risk of dying from damage because obviously he can't reach us. We are 100% at risk of getting knocked out by that, that green cloud. Um, yeah, we don't want to get stuck in that. We're gonna, in fact, I'm probably going to back up a little bit because for whatever reason, he couldn't use it when I was backed up that little bit further. Um, but this is good. This is really, really good. Oh, yeah, that's right. I was chatting to Mr. Fister and he, uh, he actually let me know this, this poison torpor rifle, assault rifle, whatever you want to call it, the tech rifle that we used to knock out the kaijus over the last couple of days. Supposedly, it is quite an uncommon drop from these dinosaurs. One in six chance, as a matter of fact. We got it on the first shot from uh, Spinebreaker. So that's why it was, that's why I was like surprised we even got it because I've never seen it before. It's a rare, it's an uncommon drop. Uh, but as you know, we still got a lot of pieces of armor to collect to complete our uh, Pugnacia tech set. So hopefully, Skarner down here hooks me up with some goods. Otherwise, uh, we might need to go kill some more Spide Breakers and Tempest to complete the set. Or maybe the Ascension. Now, the Ascension bosses, I'm pretty sure don't. So we're just gonna have to get them from somewhere. I'm not too sure where. 
Or say, just got the idea. Why don't I use Spinebreaker for this? Could have just sat Spinebreaker up here and just pelted him down with a little water strikes. But then again, this seems to be working just fine. Fifty million down. <laughs> We're a third of the way there. Ah, oh, this is uh, uh, the most exciting battle yet, isn't it? Hey, we're halfway, baby. Halfway there. 75 million health to go. <laughs> oh, the excitement. The excitement. Hey, look, I'm glad we get another easy win. I don't know. I don't know what else to tell you. Ooh, man, my fingers are getting sore. I better switch hands. <laughs> I can't mess this boss battle up, can I? Normally, I gotta worry about uh, timing my health potions or my my stamina potions, or I gotta worry about not pressing E and dismounting my dinosaur. But no, this one here, I just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. We've only got 25 million out of 144 million health remaining. Uh, but boy, boy, oh boy, I'm actually alternating hands. I'm literally alternating hands. Even playing a little bit of Raid Shadow Legends while I do this. A little bit of multitasking, never hurt nobody. And yes, I wish I was joking right now, but no, no, I'm not. <laughs> Anyways, just over 15 million health remains. I can't believe that I uh, took this guy down in his entirety with uh, such a weak attack. Damn, oh man, oh man. You know what would have been better than this? Using a dragon and breathing fire. I should have just waited for my dragon to grow up. Should have breathed fire off of a cliff and called it a day. But then again, I guess... You know what? Things have actually worked out quite lucky when you think about it, okay? Look, hear me out for a second, yeah? Hear me out for a second. Whenever I stepped that tiny little bit of a step closer, he used his poison gas. And it hit me. It actually reached me. Which tells me that if this cliff was any shorter, or even if I was just sitting slightly down that ramp over there, he probably would knock me out with it. So we have the optimal height cliff that we are sitting on top of. Any other cliff or surface, we probably wouldn't have been able to do this. So, you know what? This took planning. Accidental planning. <laughs> Anyways, I think that's it. I think he's actually been... Oh my gosh, look at all the numbers. Ah, uh, we actually did it. Just wait for those numbers to disappear because I'm pretty sure... Yep, I was going to say they're lagging my game out. Um, well, you big old beast, you. Not so tough after all, are you? Um, damn, he actually looks pretty cool. He actually looks really cool once you, like, get a good look at him. I didn't realize he was, he was so reflective. <gasps> I just realized what I'm looking at. That's the skybox. That's the... um. Obviously, we don't have a volcano behind us, do we? That's the island skybox. Hey, that's interesting. Hey, where's the, uh, where's the old RTX on the, uh, oh gosh. What do they call this stuff? Ray tracing. Where's the ray tracing? The real time ray tracing. Now nah, this looks, uh, looks cool regardless. Oh, and I gotta, I gotta work out what items I got. Well, I guess for one, I'll give you a harvest. Oh, chitin meat. Cool. I was hoping maybe we get some like metal out of him because he looks so metallic, but, uh, nope. But what did we get? Let's have a look. What are we looking for? Oh, yes. Nice. No, not nice. I've already got the leggings. Oh, no. For real? For real? You're going to give me another set of leggings? Uh, we got some loot, I guess. We got some weapons and stuff. But no. I was hoping at least for some something different. Oh, I, did, I need different sets of armor. I need I need, I need a helmet. I need some, I need, I need a torso. I need my jetpack. I need some gauntlets and some boots. Uh, we also got Skarna's decapitated head. Wow, that sounds horrible. Uh, the ramshackle Skarna's tail spike. This is a massively powerful scorpion stinger on a stick. Provides a prodigious amount of torpidity to whoever is unlucky enough to be stabbed by his vicious blade. Should we test this thing out? Um, I don't really know what we'll use it on, but I guess we got it. We got to test this thing out, don't we? Have a, oh, damn, that looks pretty sick. Oh, damn, that looks awesome. Oh, that's cool. I should go and poke Mothra up in the sky with it. Um, Yeah, get a look at that. So this is Skarna's tail. And I'm going to go and poke a magma shore with it. Probably going to knock him out with a single hit, I would think. Oh, hey. Hello, scorpions. You want to go to sleep as well? Pass your... Okay, we're just going to... We're just going to put everything to sleep, I guess. Just put the whole map to sleep. <laughs> I wonder where the... Ouch, ouch. Hey, 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 hey. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Um, kind of stuck. 
guess it didn't account for that, did it? Uh, yeah, when you when you knock two betty creatures out. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Nice. We should have taken him down a while ago. And we probably could have got some use out of this pike. But um, we've pretty much tamed everything we got to tame. Oh, okay. My gosh. It catched me so off guard. Every single... I swear he wasn't there when we flew in the opposite direction, was he? Also, what are you doing, Manticore? Why are you flying down here to land in the water? Can we get out of the water, please? Can we get out of here? Can we get... Can we, can we, can we get... Can we, can we, can, we, can we get out of here? I can't even, I can't even mount my, all right, fine. You know what, you wanna play that game? I just drank a potion because I forgot that I removed my teleporter from my hot bar. I'll teleport you back to base then. Let's go friend, let's go. We'll head home. And I guess what we could actually do now, I think we just got bitten by a shark. You know what we could technically do right now? We could get our own scan. where did my, there he is. Okay, cool. Oh, that's the damage that I just took, I guess. Uh, we can actually get our own Skarna when you think about it. Obviously, we have actually... It just occurred to me. Um, I have... I don't need to... I don't need to clone dinosaurs, really, do I? Because we can just hatch up some dragons instead. And some dragons that are actually fully grown already. Um, we can just sacrifice them. All right, let me have a little peek in here, okay? Let me see what we actually need. If I were to want... That's how this whole thing works, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So right now we've uh, we've got a couple. We've got another little tracky thing in here. We've got two of those now. Uh, man, we got so someone's attacking us. I can hear him. I can. Okay, something was attacking us. I don't know. I don't know where it went. Um, but we yeah. So we got that. We got Skana's little thing and Bobby. Uh, we, we're slowly getting them all. What am I missing right now? I got to get another spine breaker. We got to get another tempest. We got to get another Mister Fister. And a chipped hippo tooth. Yes, we haven't got to the old chipped hippo tooth yet, have we? But we will, we will, we will. Also, these leggings are better than mine, so we should probably switch those out. Yes, we definitely should. Um, but looking pretty good overall. Looking very, very good. So, what energy do I need? If I if I were to want any of these. I need myself Megapithecus and Dodorex. It's always those two, isn't it? It's always Megapithecus or Dodorex. Uh, it, it is never anything but those two. So, I guess, I guess we'll have to go ahead and get those. I'm actually curious as well, since we've got a back... Oh, oh my gosh, the dragon tails. Dragon tails! I'm um, kind of curious, though. Obviously, we're going to break this stuff up. i uh, got some saddles as well. But what do we end up getting from these leggings? That's what I want to find out. So, we got got four, 4,487 metal in there already. What? 4,400. I think we just got 500. It seems that you get 500 from every one of these special tier items. But we also got some black pearls, which is pretty good. Black pearls are really good, as a matter of fact. That's actually that's actually very nice to. That's actually pretty cool to see. Uh, what do we get for this? I'm not going to use it. Let's break it. Oh, it doesn't break. Okay, interesting. Not interesting, but like fair enough. Fair enough, I guess. Cool. Well, do we want to get ourselves a scanner? Do we want to do it? We may as well. We may as well. no. But then if I do that, and then I got to go and kill another one eventually as well. Ooh. But then again, now that we've killed one, we could like. I'm sure we can do it again. Yeah, I'm sure we'll be fine. I'm sure we'll be okay. All right, all right, all right. We're going to go kill some stuff. Um, Hello, Luther Titan. You're knocking down my trees. I was looking for a man. Let's just take our new dragon out. Yeah, he looks cool. I want to take my dragon out. Where are you, buddy? Where are you? There you are. Oh, my gosh. It looks so cool. Oh, I love it. 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 A bit. Let's go, friends. Let's go. Of course, you're going to get stuck. Oh, we're good. We're good. All right. So back on the old Dota Rex hunt. Let me quickly just dip down here. We're going to get some nice old experience for some kills. Let's 55 levels already. I love it to bits, man. Oh my gosh. A little bit of melee damage because who needs health? Actually, we could actually take this dragon to the arena and use him in there, couldn't we? So maybe health. Health would definitely be very useful against the Megapithecus. We've been having a little bit of trouble with the old Megapithecus, haven't we? So that's probably uh, what we're going to use that on. Uh, but I need my... How do I always lose this thing, man? The scanner. I need the scanner. So we're looking for a Dorex. Where is a Dorex? Oh, man, there's so many of them. Um, there are absolute tons of them. All right, I'm going to go for that one. 50, 36. Sounds easy enough to find. And another one of these guys. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. I'm sure he just gave us like an absolute truckload of levels. In fact, I... You know what? In fact, where's that disgusting vile beast? There you are. 
me get my spyglass out so I can actually see it. Oh, fire breath doesn't affect you? Oh, you're too cool for fight. All right, fine. <laughs> I was going to say, using melee attacks right now because we're such a low level, probably not going to be good enough. So I think we're heading, I think it's going to be along this edge. Oh, Manticore. No, that's Zuko. Hey, I'll take you down as well. Even though Zuko doesn't seem to give me experience whenever I fight him, it might actually be. I think, you know why I don't think Zuko gives us experience? Actually, I didn't even know if he did just then. I don't know if it was the Phoenix or him. But I think Zuko is meant to be a minion of Iroh. But I think my spawn settings are a little bit buggered up. So I think that might be why ours work a little different. Anyways, I think it's normal that minions aren't meant to give you uh, experience. Is what I'm getting at. Okay, so Dodorex. I can't remember my second coordinate that I'm looking for. But I'm pretty sure he should be around here somewhere. I'll check it in a sec. But yeah, no, he's definitely not around here. Okay, let's have a look. Nope, that's my rifle. There we go. Dodorex, where are you, friend? Where are you? 5065. That's nowhere near where I am. 4937. That's the one I'm looking for. 4937. <laughs> Mr. Pile Longshot. He's up here, apparently. Um. Oh. I needed one of these guys too, didn't I? Hey, that actually works out really good. Two in one, baby. Two in one. Okay, so 4937. Oh, he's over here. No, surely not. Did I, like, really mess this up? Another Phoenix. We got some Beast Titans. There are so many Phoenixes around, though, aren't there? Where's the Dodorex? I don't know why I keep trying to breathe fire on a Phoenix. They're made of fire. Why would fire hurt a Phoenix when it's already made of fire? You absolute dummy. Um, Dodorex, though. I could be blind. Oh, hold on. I gotta go to... I gotta go north a bit. All right. Little Titans. Chill out. I'll come for you in a second. Uh, okay. There he is. He's got his head hidden in the cliff face. All right, sorry, buddy. Uh, let me let me give you a hand there, eh? Let me give you a hand. Also, actually, I just, just thought of something, right? I have been getting a lot of messages for a while now, and it just completely, like, skips my mind. A lot of people have been telling me i got to check out the uh, Dodo Wyvern. Apparently, Dodo Wyverns are ridiculously powerful in this mod, and I don't have one yet. Should we go and find one? I could actually, I could literally, I could do it. I could make it happen. Actually, no, I can't. I need to go to base. I gotta go and get the little taming things for him. I think we gotta do that eventually. I, I, it's obviously not a, a job for right this second, um, but it's, it's definitely one of those things that we uh, we need to save up for. I've got a rogue Jaeger just over there. He's about to probably attack our base, but let's just ignore him for the time being. Uh, so there we go. We've got all of the little energies that we need. I guess it's up to us now what we wanna do. Let's get ourselves a Skana. Let's check this guy out, hey? Let's do this thing. What do we got to lose? So, my little pretty babies. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry for this, but um, one of you is getting transformed, I'm afraid. <laughs> this wasn't my intention, but uh, hey, it didn't end up too badly. Why are you underground? And can you not be underground, please? Uh, can you? Hey, there we go. Okay, good. Um, you're stuck, though. You're stuck. Okay, let's not use that attack in the base, please. Oh, okay. That worked out all right. No, it doesn't. You're still stuck. Um, okay. Dragon, do you mind just stepping aside? Yes, I just sacrificed your baby. I apologize. <laughs> but I got to see what the old uh, Scorpio is about, eh? There we go. All right. He's kind of slow, but that's fine. We're going to put some levels into movement speed to give him a little bit of a... Blue. Speed him up a little bit. Um, Trees. Trees seem to be his worst nightmare. Also, I picked up a Jerboa. Wait, what? I think I've got a Jerboa on the end of my stinger. Is that a thing? Oh, wow. 60,000 damage. Yeah, you can legit pick stuff up. I've got a track. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Is there a limit to like the size? I didn't even think. This guy could actually... Wait, can I pick up? I want to pick up this guy. I want to pick up the, the Spino. Yo, I can pick up a Spino. Um, I didn't even think, but this guy could be helpful for the boss battles. Like in the Ascension Arena. Didn't even consider it. Unfortunately, his primary attack is obviously dealing poison, which isn't going to help us with those because bosses generally can't be poisoned. Um, what was that attack? Okay. Don't recognize that one there, but damn that stinger it hits. It lands. All right. Some speed. It's getting some damage. And then we'll focus on the health, you know, when the time comes. But right now, I just, I just want to see what sort of damage we can deal. Let's give him a saddle. We got some little primals over here. 90,000? I mean, we could 
get a couple hundred K, like, K out of this guy. Doesn't have an X attack. Um, but he's got this C attack, which I don't know if that's the poison attack. Sometimes the left click wants to do a poison, and then other times it's the other, the, 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 I don't know. Maybe it is the C attack, because right now we just, we're just swinging our little spike around. Kind of want to see, can I pick up a Brontosaurus? I gotta find something big. If I can pick up a Spino with my, with my pincer. No, it's not even a pincer, is it? It's, it's a stinger. If I can pick up a Spino with a stinger, then I'm shooman. I can get something extra, extra large. I can hit Godzilla. I don't know where he is. Imagine if you could pick up a Godzilla. That would be pretty impressive, but I doubt it. Mega Shalon. Come here, buddy. Can I pick you up? Oh my god, we can pick up a giant crab. Uh, turtle, whatever this thing is. Okay. Okay. What else can you pick up then? Hold on. I'll try Bronto. I'll try Bronto. If this actually works. What's the. What is the limit? What is the limits of this stinger? This stinger, he could lift up the world, man. I should call this guy Atlas. Watch me. You know Atlas, the, the, the uh, Greek god who can lift up the earth? Oh, hold on. Godzilla's nearby. Oh, that's my Godzilla. Never mind. Uh, where's the wild Godzilla? I got, I got to try. I've got to try and pick up wild Godzilla. Ah, uh, there he is. He was hiding from us. Well, the moment of truth. Can we pick him up? <laughs> Seriously, this would be so good. This would be so good. Oh, all right. He can't pick up Titans. Yeah, I don't know what I expected. I didn't ex Oh, maybe we just keep picking up Trikers instead. Maybe that's why. Oh my gosh. I thought we had it there for a second, but no. It's not happening. No, no, no. You can't pick up Titans, unfortunately. Monsters are... Well, fine. That's fine. Hey, instead, you know what we could do? Uh, nothing? Because I'm stunned. Now, we can give him a little bit of a poison blast. <gasps> Wait a second. What we could do is... Oh, I knocked him out. Oh my god, I knocked him out. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. I could actually tame him up right now. I don't need another Godzilla, man. <laughs> but regardless, um, our Scorpio here... Uh, he's actually stunning me right now. Um, our Scorpion can do ridiculous damage. Like, like, stu sorry, Torpor. Ridiculous Torpor. Billions of Torpor, as a matter of fact. He's about as strong as our rifle, which is probably as strong as the, uh, the, the spear that we obtained from Skana. Skana's little tail there. So, dude, what a machine. But have a look at this. We're over 100,000 damage, and he hits rapidly, too. We've just dealt seven. Imagine once you put, like, 300 levels into damage on this guy. Get a couple hundred thousand damage, and he's hitting as quick as this. Anyways, so we can actually find out in just a second. He's down. 62 more levels. I'm probably not going to bother with that right now. I think we're going to take our new friend all the way home. And uh, we're probably going to call it a day. Well, guys, today was a fun one. We met, killed, and then tamed up the big old Scorpion King. If you did enjoy this video, please go ahead. Punch that thumbs up. Make it rain. Those thumbs ups. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to make sure you don't miss any of our upcoming uploads. But most importantly, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.